Well, hey, fuckers. Good morning. Happy Taco Tuesday. Guess what time it is? Hey, Sharon, what's the tea? Let's find out what the tea is for you fuckers today. Tap that screen and remember, there's no hashtags on this shit. Don't make it fit. Use your discernment and remember, it's on your For You page. Pay attention. Tap that screen. All right, Spirit. What is the tea for my collectives on this fine Taco Tuesday? Make sure you eat your taco today. But you gonna eat your cornbread? That nice, buttery, smooth, fat, juicy cornbread. <laughs> okay, today. Oh, somebody's got some good vibes today. Ah, yeah, I like it. In the moment. Living in the moment. Okay, I'm digging that. I'm digging that. Impulsive. Good, good, good. Ooh. Detective. Okay, so somebody's been snooping and digging for dirt. Possibly even making accusations. Interesting. Okay. Roller coaster. So whoever this is, is full of highs and lows, off and on, on and off again, hot and cold with you. And they're snooping on you. But today they have good vibes. Um... Mm. Interesting. Their good vibes today is going to lead them to, bye Felicia, okay, peace and out, thank you next, leaving and not caring. Okay. I'm smelling a breakup that somebody feels good about. Interesting. Interesting. So somebody has, through research, detective work, snooping, has figured out that there is a key player in their life, okay? This is an important person, plays an essential role, a, an irreplaceable person. Whoever this is, is happy about saying goodbye to someone, not caring, they're happy about leaving, they've been digging dirt on someone that's a, an important person in their life, Someone that they've been hot and cold with in and out of their life like a roller coaster. Red flag. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like this is a risky situation. Okay. Um, take heed of the warning signs. Make sure you're paying attention to your gut and any red flags that come about when this person comes in and out of your life. Repo. <laughs> yes. I feel like Something is going on with this person and their assets today. Like, they're losing assets. And I feel like it's crazy because they feel good about it. Like, it's a good thing. Interesting. Tell me more about this detective situation with this person, this important person, this irreplaceable person. Skirt! Quick getaway, the runner, escaping. Wow. <laughs> yeah, this person's definitely saying bye, Felicia. Wow. My boo. Interesting. Official status, exclusive relationship, seeing each other openly. Okay, so what I'm picking up is your person that you tapped in about is feeling really good because they are leaving a situation. And in turn, this is a this is a home life situation because they're losing the assets and this is all due to someone digging dirt and making accusations through detective work. This person has played an essential role in your person's life. So I feel like this is a third party, could be even a spouse, but your person's running quickly from this situation. Um, I feel like your person has come to this precipice as 
a realization and understanding that this is not the person they want to be with. This, this person for you has been in and out of your life, full of highs and lows, hot and cold. And you feel even, I feel like you have warning signs that makes you feel like this is a risky situation. And I feel like your person also feels like it's a risky situation as well. But they want you to be their boo. They, they want the official status to be you and this person together in an exclusive relationship, seeing each other openly without having to sneak around. I feel like this hot and cold is about to change. Clarify what's happening today with the assets. Please, Vera. Hmm. Okay. So whoever your person is, is openly working with whoever this is to divide their assets. Okay. Um, they're cooperating with each other, working as a team. The four of cups. I feel like this this person, whoever they're collaborating with, is typically unappreciative, and this person has been bored with this person and has had need has, and has been meditating for a while, and felt very lonely with this person, very out in the cold, very poverty, possible financial loss as well as emotional loss here. Okay, uh, and whatever this is, whatever's happening right now, I feel like. There is this energy of wanting to move forward, wanting to work hard, and and I feel like they feel really good about it. I feel like they feel excited for this new this new adventure, right? Because as of right as of late, I feel like this person's been under a microscope. I feel like there's been detective work on this person, and this person is who's been doing the investigations has been their spouse. Okay, we're just gonna call it their spouse. I don't know if they're married or not, whatever the case, but it's their spouse. And this spouse has played a key role in their, a very important key role in their life, very essential for a very, very long time. And this person's running from it because <clears throat> they're leaving the situation because this is how this person made them feel. Always up with anxiety, scared, not knowing, um, suffering in their head. Okay, this person has gotten some mental clarity, has had an aha moment, and they finally have realized that it's time to make some changes and it's time to complete the cycle. Eight of Wands, they are coming in hot, okay? They're coming in hot to you. They're gonna make their move towards you, all right? I would say, and what's weird is today's the 8th of October, interesting okay so this person is coming forward to you you might feel a little like mm, a little apprehensive just I feel like you guys had some sort of a, a connection that was on and on and off again so it's a little it would be a little jarring and unexpected at first for you to be like really I don't are you sure like I don't know if I want to do this but yeah this person is definitely making plans right now as we speak to come forward and it's going to be fucking fast they want to be your boo they want to be out in the open with a new beginning with you open they, they're willing to take a leap of faith they don't know how it's going to work out but they want to they want to do it they're ready they're ready for a new adventure a new life and with the Four of Swords, yeah, I feel like this person's been needing to slow down and take some rest. And there's been a lot of uncertainty in their life, a lot of deception. But the rose-colored glasses have come off and the decision has been made. And they are leaving their third party, which is their spouse. I feel like it's a spouse. I feel very strongly it's a spouse. And this is your person. <laughs> I can't make this shit up. This is your Two of Cups. This, you have a divine connection with this person. Yeah, soulmate or twin flame, one of the two, okay? And this person knows it, and they are coming for you. And I'm hearing this person thinks you are their soulmate, and they have a lot of regret for how they treated you with the off and, off and on again, hot and cold. Yeah, they are, I feel like an apology is coming in from them to you and to reconcile any differences or conflicts between the two of you.